Hey gang, Jeff Wizery, jeffwizery.com. Coming at you once again with my blog 101 uh, training for beginners or newbies as we affectionately call you guys uh, in the industry here. We were all there once so it's okay, you gotta start somewhere and uh, I just wanted to uh, make the transition uh, into the blogging world a little easier and uh, break it down to elementary steps. Uh, in this video we're just going to uh, talk about um, the WordPress uh, basically the dashboard. That's kind of the first item you see once you log into WordPress. Um, hopefully my computer is uh, running a little bit better today. Uh, this shows the name of your blog, uh, the official uh, blog of Jeff Wizry, uh, and you can see the dashboard. This is the main uh, on the left hand column all your uh, basic commands for all the different uh, components of your blog is here uh, to the left. You see the dashboard there. Uh, it'll bring up um, when you first log in the dashboard uh, screen. Uh, it's pretty nice and I'll just kind of uh, jump uh, on some of the uh, quick items that I view every time I log in. Uh, it obviously shows how many posts, um, you know, uh, the categories of your posts, uh, how many tags you've put in, um, and then it also shows how many people have commented on your uh, posts. Uh, how many that you've approved, how many are pending, and then there's some spam in there. Um, the spam is controlled by uh, an Ask Emet key, uh, and that's something you should get uh, installed, whether you're doing it yourself or uh, somebody who's professionally installing your blog. Uh, and then um, over here, this Quick Press is just, uh, generally I never use this, but if you wanted to just uh, post something quickly from your uh, dashboard, you could. Uh, I did another video on uh, how to post your uh, first content uh, on an earlier video and that would be under the posts and add new but we that's not the uh, subject of this video so we'll skip that shows your recent drafts uh, if you are um, working on a post uh, usually WordPress will auto save it and that will remind you that there's a draft there if you've forgotten with everything that goes on in this uh, uh, world of network marketing sometimes it's easier to forget that you were working on a post at 3 in the morning um, and then here, WordPress has their latest uh, news. Uh, right now, it looks like they released their 3.0 beta stage. Um, and so, as with all programs, they're constantly improving. Um, so you can kind of keep track of the uh, different news coming out on WordPress. And then uh, down here, there's other WordPress news. Um, you'll get some uh, good snippets of information there. All you have to do is click on uh, these uh, posts or articles, and you'll be taken to them if you see a, a headline that uh, seems like you want to learn something more about, uh, that's where you'll see it. And then down here, um, the comments, uh, once you create a post and you start uh, trying to uh, get syndicated, get other people to look at your posts, uh, the best way to do it is to comment on other people's posts, invite them to comment on yours. You'll see all the recent comments here. And then from here, you can, if you forgot to approve a comment, it'll say approve, you can hit approve. Now it's on unapproved because if I, I already approved it, of course. And then you always want to reply to your comments uh, and uh, say some nice words, unless a person uh, says a bunch of mean and nasty things, which I've never seen yet. Everybody in this community seems to be very supportive and helpful. So shouldn't have to worry about that. And then um, down here, uh, plugins. And I'm going to do a, another video on plugins. Plugins are basically just uh, mini little software programs that you can. Uh, upload into your blog that make your blog perform and function and automate better for you. Um, so uh, these are some of the uh, most popular plugins, the newest plugins, and the recently updated. Now I won't go into plugins too much, but if you were to click on that, generally you'll be taken to the website and uh, you can upload, uh, download the program, then upload it into uh, your WordPress back office and it'll become one of your uh, plugins and uh, uh, automate your blog, your blog that much more. Uh, and then um, uh, there's some more stuff. Uh, I, I don't really pay much attention to this area here, blog play and JW player. What I do look at though is the stats. Uh, I do use uh, Stat Counter. It's a program that gets really detailed on all your stats, where your page views are coming from, uh, unique visitors, returning visitors. But this just kind of gives you an idea if there's a spike, if you put out maybe a good um, uh, post one day, a lot of people look at it, that will spike uh, and you can uh, see that graph quickly. Uh, and then top posts over here, it shows uh, who's uh, really viewing your posts and uh, which ones are getting the most views. 
and then which posts are the most active and it shows you the different uh, number of views here. So you can kind of tell which posts are creating the most activity. And then if you want to view them all, you can hit the view all button. So that's just a quick update on the dashboard as we know it in WordPress. Uh, again, if you have any uh, amount of experience, uh, this is not going to do much for you. But uh, if you are just entering this world, I think it's a good idea to have some of these tutorial videos. If you did find value in this uh, post, uh, please retweet it and dig it. And uh, enter your comments in the comment section of my blog. Until I see each and all of you in another video, I want to wish every one of you the best of luck.